you guys, it's Poe back again with Let's Get Techie. Today's going to be a little bit uh, different video than you're used to seeing. Uh, I'm going to be doing some more talking today, uh, which may or may not be a good thing depending on what you're looking for. So, uh, it's a little bit of a rant, although I'll try to not make it sound that way. Um, I'm kind of upset. Um, unfortunately, miners have gone and ruined things for everyone. Uh, so I'm sure all of you know uh, the mining craze that's going on right now with cryptocurrency. Uh, it's impossible to get an AMD graphics card right now. Even the older generation, R9, 390, 380, those type of cards are also being used. Uh, the reason being is AMD's hardware, for whatever reason, uh, works a little bit better than NVIDIA's uh, for this type of mining. That being said, since all of the AMD cards are currently sold out and going for ridiculous prices, people have turned to NVIDIA and the 1070 is now also sold out and selling for ridiculous prices. Um, so anybody that's on the upper end above a 1070, uh, you're largely unaffected. Um, for whatever reason, the G5X memory that's on the 1080 and 1080 Ti uh, makes it less optimal for mining. Um, so that's a good thing if you have that kind of money to spend on a graphics card. Uh, but what are you going to do if you don't have that kind of money to spend on a graphics card? It doesn't make sense to go out and buy a 1070 or an RX 480 or 580 if it's going to cost you close to the same amount of money as a 1080. We're right back where we started where it's too much money, it's out of your budget. Uh, so today um, other than bitching and moaning and talking about how the miners have just f***ed things up for everybody, um, we're going to talk about some alternatives. Uh, so I looked up some pricing and what my goal is with this video is to let you know what you can get on the used market that's comparable to Pascal generation cards from NVIDIA. So first up, if you were planning on going uh, 1080p, maybe dabble in some 1440. I would compare the GTX 970 uh, Maxwell architecture. That card is going to closely resemble a GTX 1060 3 gigabyte card. Um, moving up, if you take a look at the 980 non TI again from Maxwell, that is going to uh, compare very well with the 1060 6 gigabyte card. Um, those are able to be found on eBay. I uh, checked pricing on the 970 and the 980 uh, prior to recording and it looks like pricing is actually right in line with a 1063 gig and 1066 gig respectively. Um, if you're moving up and you're in 1440p, let's say you've got a 1440p monitor and that's what you game on all the time, I would suggest taking a look at the 980 Ti. Now normally we would be recommending a GTX 1070 uh, for this type of workload. Again with them being A sold out and B scalped for ridiculous prices. Uh, it just does not make sense to buy a 1070 right now so I would encourage a 980 Ti. Um, that's going to give you very similar performance to a 1070. Um, it's going to cost a little bit less than a 1070 MSRP. Uh, probably about half the price or close to it of what 1070s are actually selling for right now. Uh, and that's going to give you a good 1440p experience. Uh, it could also work for some high refresh 1440 as well. Um, I hate that it has come to this. I hate that there really aren't any new cards that are budget options for people that are 1080p and 1440p right now. Um, luckily it hasn't went down. You, you still have no problem getting a 1050 and a 1050 Ti. Um, honestly, I'm not sure if the 1060 is being used for mining or not. Um, hold that thought. This is my shocked face. In case you haven't seen that yet, this is my shocked face. I promise you I had not looked at 1060s prior to beginning uh, the recording of this video. You are getting my live reaction to 1060 prices. Um, I saw one on Newegg for 600 bucks. That is nuts. 
That is nuts, and I hope no one is buying that. Please do not buy that. Um, so yeah, 1060s are also being used for mining. Um, that is incredibly unfortunate. Uh, I hate that it's come to this. I hate that people who want to game on PC don't have the options that they used to. Um, I hate it for people who are considering getting into PC gaming. Um, I'm not against console at all. I've got an Xbox One. I'll probably end up getting the new Xbox One X. There's nothing wrong with that, but I always love to see new people getting into PCs and PC gaming. And what this is doing right now is inhibiting that from happening, and I absolutely hate it. I hate it so much. Um, unfortunately, there's nothing we can do about it, though. The world is driven by money. Right now, you can make money mining. Um, that's a whole discussion for a different video. Um, but you can make money doing it right now, and that's why all of these cards are sold out. That's why all of these cards are being scalped for ridiculous prices. Um, we're talking in the $800 range for a 1070. You can go out and get a 1080 for 500, sometimes even less than 500. Um, it's nice that the upper end, the 1080 and the 1080 Ti is still an option for people, but um, if you don't have that kind of money, your only other option is the Maxwell generation or um, a 1050 and a 1050 Ti. You can't even get into the older AMD cards because those are also being used for mining. We're talking about prices on an R9 390X uh, in the $350 range, which I would also recommend against very highly. Um, I just want to say I'm sorry. I hate that this is happening. Um, I also want to apologize for my rant video. Hopefully, uh, you guys will have a few more options uh, after watching this, and I hope it does not deter people from getting into PC and PC gaming. Um, I hope you enjoyed this one, and we'll see you in the next one.